to Jesus. actually address what I'm saying. Sorry. I don't want to hear your pontifications. Gus, does it look like your brain and my brain are on the same level? I thought so. Now, well, please, if you shut you up know. for two seconds, I could probably <laughs> I show you. So. <laughs> but, you're, but you're doing the same thing that Galactica does when it gets attacked. You're just throwing flak in the air. Okay. And unfortunately, uh, that's not okay. an argument no technique. Reference. And it's part of okay. how you're going to okay. end up getting muted in here eventually. I, di I, I didn't do anything. Tommy, are you moderating even? Tommy? Tommy. Tommy. You should, last you night. should Tommy. do, you know, you need to take some own initiative, like, and uh, try and make your conversation better yourself. Don't don't make me do all your work. If you want to, sometimes to. But you muted me. But you muted me. Be that was because of your dumbass fucking notifications. Yeah. So two things. Um, one doesn't beg um, the question. It's not an argument. I'm not making an argument. Two. So why, why do we need to listen hello? to your pontifications? Hi? Hello? Oh my god. This, and is, watch this is part of your procedure. You're, you're, asking, you're begging me for moderation. You should just let your interlocutor talk. Yeah, two. Okay, um, I, I think most people... There are certain things you can appeal to that will like motivate you not to do certain things in the context of a social environment. So here's an example. Right In this social environment, it's frowned upon to say the N-word. Now, it may not be the case that there's something intrinsically wrong with blurting out the N-word as like a white person, but it's still kind of uh, discouraged because you'll immediately receive social criticism for it. You can apply this, this, uh, this thinking to society at large, right? Generally speaking, people kind of upon, frown upon people who rape others because that act is perceived to be exceptionally harmful, creates trauma, creates... Uh, you know, long lasting mental damage. So it doesn't need to be the case that some argument for it being intrinsically wrong needs to be provided. It could just be something as simple as the reason most people find it to be bad is because they perceive it to be a harmful act. Okay, good. Now we're talking about a situation where a person was having a schizophrenic episode. Now, of oh, course, God. just a second, just a second, just a second. Just a second. Hell, dude. There is very little evidence, right, that this person will even remember this episode at all. So how can you say it's harmful if it's blotted away from the memory? Because I don't think you have access to the information necessary to say that it wasn't. And I, I think, think I, who? and I think there's a lot of examples of people being raped and then having long lasting mental trauma. Okay, kind but of the person has never contacted police just to say sorry. No. No, just a second. If I if I if somebody was if somebody was felt that they were abused, they would have contacted the police. That hasn't happened. Why do you think you're more knowledgeable told. than... I didn't even hear the question. What did he say? About social he said that if Thank someone you. had felt... Saying... Shut up. Defer. Sometimes, idiot. He said that sometimes... He said... Sorry. He said that if a person had felt abused, they would have called the police. No, that doesn't follow. There are plenty of examples of people in abusive relationships not calling the police because of the fear of consequence, specifically being beaten. There are also people who have the belief that the police won't listen to them for whatever reason. That doesn't make it the case that they weren't harmed. There are people who blame themselves for the rape, too. And this is a lot yeah. of stuff. Well, more to the point, though, I mean, Hogan, or Pogan was talking about social convention. It is considered to be ex extremely incorrect by social convention to um, make uh, sexual advances on someone who is not capable of cogently and fully you know giving consent so strike two or able to remember yeah i don't know why you put yourself in these situations nobody's gonna like buy this whole jack angstrike fucking philosophy rabbit hole bullshit it's it's more than sufficient to just say i along with most people have a natural revulsion to rapists no further explanation is really necessary tommy tommy are you gonna moderate these trolls i'm never i'm never gonna call you tom again well like canadian uh, like Catholic, like within his own ability has he can just make his conversations like with where he doesn't need someone to step in and moderate. He's, I mean, he, he's not making like any effort. 
There's an additional piece of evidence here, apparently, that I wasn't aware of. Now, if somebody can back this up, it'd be appreciated. But Holy Tree is saying in the conversation where he revealed like the details of the incident, uh, CC specifically said that the girl like erroneously thought CC was her boy, uh, her boyfriend. Like, like it was a case of like mistaken identity. Yeah. But she was having an episode, wasn't she? Well, that's my point, yeah. right? That, that further supports the idea that the consent wasn't really valid, even if she was able to provide consent. Cause she had no yeah, exactly. fucking, she had no fucking clue who CC was. And in fact, misidentified him. Unfortunately, uh, did he did he ask for consent? Uh, presumably, because that's even worse, right? He didn't even bother to ask. Well, the the point is, like, even if he did, it's irrelevant because people with schizophrenia actively disassociating cannot provide consent, and she was and put in that hospital against her will. And don't forget, he bribed he bribed someone with his cell phone that he wasn't supposed to have in there. Uh, to be a lookout at the door while he did his... his oh, my God. Oh, see, now that I didn't yeah. know. That's, That's crazy. Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah. So, you're, you're, so he said he said you're not That's supposed right. to have a phone, and, and what he did is he pulled out his phone and gave it to someone and said, hey, keep watch for a little while. You can use my phone while I'm, while I'm doing it. Keep my- watch, dude. Jesus. He's repented, boys. I He's repented. Watch person. Play some Candy Crush. Hang out. Now I remember. Who's, who's Damn, that's crazy, bro. It's looking really bad for you. Yeah, CC. that's grimy, bro. Uh, he knows he's fucked now. Um. Tell me why you're not moderating the overtalking. I'm sure Jovan didn't do anything as bad as this. <laughs> Jesus. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah. This guy has free fucking travel to and fro anyway whatever that was a magical like just injecting way it was so good oh my god hey, bb are you actually oh my there god. right now oh, oh, my god. BB. oh bb are you there bb please can you, can are you, you there? Catholic, did, did, did you not bribe someone with your cell phone to, to stand lookout outside no i didn't door? actually no, I didn't. Some, somebody just came in, and I just gave them the phone so they would stay away. They didn't actually know I had to. But I had uh, but As if that you makes it look better. better. Okay, can we move on from this? BB, can you unmute yourself? You needed a lookout so that nobody would see you rape a schizophrenic woman, right? All right. Do you remember? Enough, enough, enough. Oh, my God. Okay, BB. This is the first time I've heard it. This is hard to let go. That's, don't listen to them, whoever you Why are. Why do you want to harass Baby now? Baby. What do you want to Tom, I find her. Hey, hey one, one second, rapist. I need to get some clarity on something. Is it like, <laughs> is it the attacking or is it just the content that you're like taking issue it's with? It's the frequency, I think. I mean, just for, for right now, more of the latter. It's just nobody really wants to just keep hearing it. I mean, it's just it's redundant. Like, I, I can't. heard it all last night. Now, yeah, Bibi, that's fine. Can you unmute yourself? Oh, good. BB, can you unmute yourself? I mean, to be honest, it's both, but I mean, immediately, it just you, you, you're just you're just nuking everything. Yeah, you get Pogan, you get more if you didn't do it like that. Okay. BB, can you unmute yourself, please? What are you harassing her for? What do you want? I want I want to hear her voice. I kind of I kind of Shut the fuck oh, up, dude. We're n- She's not here to fucking just amuse you she's not here to be your own personal asmr in a room of 40 people but can i at least hear her voice i kind of miss it (laughs) just absolutely fucking revolting every single time he speaks yeah it's been months this is your this this is your like alter ego this is me if I, That's you know, alter ego. drink tap water at like age five. Yeah, I, don't, is... I don't. I don't think there's any scenario where Pogan would do this. Yeah, if you try, Pogan, if this you is get, you in the funhouse mirror. If you yeah, get this into like, BB, a little bit, BB, if I, like Canadian I think... Catholics Mary Jane, if he were, he's like trying to emulate every single behavior of Jax. If I was like, <laughs> if I was like obese and brain damaged, and I like drank tap water for six straight years and nothing else, what do you mean? 
Maybe Canadian Catholic. Tap water is safe like, to drink, okay? Are you yeah, a, are to, you a tap you'd water have to drink to... like Flint water? Gus, I live in Gus, I live in West Virginia. I'm not really inclined to trust the tap water there. You know. Well, oh, ours is here really in good. Canada, where tap water is like I don't know important, we fucking make sure it's drinkable. Yeah. Yeah, ours is really strict. It's really good. I still get a filter on it, but still. let me let me put it to you like this. Um, a couple of years ago, I went to the kitchen to get a glass of water, and the filter wasn't working, so I just used the tap. Your voice and it was brown. Ew. I miss it. Oh God! Jesus, dude! Your voice is intoxicating. I miss it. Wow. Maybe please, your voice, your voice the makes me hall, feel things. Me, meanwhile, at, at the next town hall, when the the concept of like a mild property tax or an income tax comes up. I bet there's like people literally willing to nail themselves to a cross in protest and pay a little bit to help the drinking water out. <laughs> what's wrong with tap water? I don't get the problem. Shut up, rapist. Yeah, it's what's wrong with yeah, tap water in Canada. Episode. There's yeah. nothing wrong with tap water in Canada. What's wrong with tap water in the States? It depends on the state. But I, I wasn't aware that there was such a problem. Oh, I'm glad that you're not. Isn't Canadian sucking Maybe you should leave those $500 yeah, books did. behind. You're not aware of a lot of problems, to be fair. Well, I should give a read to them five hundred dollar books behind you. Gus, are, are huh? your brains what? the same size? I thought so. Uh, <laughs> Stupid. Well, well, my 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 brain is just mush. It's it's it's, it's, it's I, 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 I I can't. Yeah, Tommy, 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 are you here? Tommy, are you going to my trouble talking, please? Tommy, are you okay? Tommy, are you okay? Are you okay, Tommy? <laughs> we need we need a we need another voice of black reason. Well, Don't thank me goodness me I'm when... here. I'm here now, Concrete. <laughs> Let me know when fair. one shows up. I'm sorry. Snugs, I don't think you quite Can I be the voice of black Jesus. everything? Snugs, Snugs literally, like, literally a phantom. Like, the complexion of, like, cat. Concrete, you're goes. just a redeeming... It's called... It's called... It's called... Call, call, like four or five it's black people here. I think we have enough for... Yeah, you're just oh, reverse vitiligo. Okay, reverse vitiligo. Is it really? Yeah. Feature of the server. Our volunteers tribute. No, wait, no. Reverse vitiligo <laughs> makes you black. No, what? What? Nobody. What? Six has is vitiligo. Concrete, you're just a redeemer. Why are you scared? Do you think you all of a sudden everybody's going to catch fire? Feature of the server. I am the bringer of chaos. Uncle Uncle yeah, Ruckus has reverse one. vitiligo. Having a little trouble with the bot there, Tom. No, <laughs> I wanted to play it four times. Oh. I wanted to play it four times. Damn. He's mad, Ray. He mad. He, <laughs> he, he mentioned the, the person as well, right? Just gets pissier and pissier. I'm really starting to reach into my uh, couple day hiatus from uh, Tomlin boxes now. Con concrete, concrete. What's your opinion of the Pope? The Hold on, it's like really, really quick. And my patience is running out. The part of Christianity that sees itself out in the My patience is running. Out. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? <laughs> what was that? Oh, uh, what was that? Just, just to be clear, Canadian Catholic, are you still under the impression that concrete is the one redeeming feature of the server? I'm torn because I think concrete has some good opinions and good takes, but I find his approach not really helpful. Not the best. You say the same about Darth Dawkins? No, Darth Dawkins. Darth Dawkins hates me now, so I don't know. Well, what is you uh, so I don't know. do with whether he hates you or not? Think, what do you think about his approach? I think he's a fucking moron. Okay. The use of that sort of language is not permitted under Christian doctrine. If Concrete hated you, would you feel the same way about him? Um. Concrete, <laughs> okay. God, God, is that you moaning on the? <laughs> <laughs> sounded like my fucking dog when she's crying. Uh, 
Where's Jack? Oh, I, fuck. I, why doesn't Jack ever come in here? Why does Jack never come in here? What is he not here, Jack? Okay, dude, do, where's, where's Jack, dude, you hear the frustration Jack, in my Jack, voice? I'm ordinarily a patient person. He's all like sugar there. Do you think God will forgive you? Absolutely no, not. I would die for your voice. Rainy's being a weird. Yeah, baby, let's hear it. Yeah, baby, let's hear it. Come on. I've I I haven't heard your voice in months. You're such a fucking creep, months. dude. You're so fucking weird, man. Okay, this is bullying, Tommy. This is bullying. <laughs> but, 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 but I'm a creep, I, I, I think. Um, BB's taken. You can't flirt with her. Mm. Oh, she's taken? Damn. Yeah. Okay. okay. Thank you. Tommy. By the way, by the way, just, uh... I'm just chilling in Cedar Rapids. <laughs> do, no, no, I actually needed that. People... Yeah, by the way, I uh, did you the convenience of actually looking up the uh, definition of rape as it applies oh, to Canadian yeah. law. Uh, um, can we not we talk in the about event, the rape in the, thing? In, yeah, let's get over it, man. Women loves calling rape people. In, like in the event of uh, somebody oh, being... Somebody if you want to do something, excuse, just report him to the police. I'm not, a, I'm not be... a Canadian. In the event of somebody being admitted to a hospital against their will, at that time, their legal capacity to provide consent is revoked under Canadian stature. Okay, that's just... Okay, let's... let's if you really think let's, let's I am for whatever you. reason... We're moving on. We're moving on. Ogan! Ogan, come on. No, no, we're, we're, we're moving on. No, 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 please, please. Tommy, Tommy, Tommy. Okay. I was a little skeptical of you saying Who's that Tommy? Canadian law would protect what you did, so I, I did, in fact, look it up, and uh, you were wrong. What did I do? I had sex outside, I had sex outside of marriage, and I'm regretful for that. You had sex with but, somebody who didn't have the legal power of consent. Like, we weren't going to talk about it. Yeah, okay, good. Finally, um, Tommy's waking now, up. Oh, that's not Tommy, it's Bard. <laughs> Tommy. Oh, oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, sorry, you guys have the same here. voice. You guys don't need me to resolve this issue. You guys also don't want to hear about it and just express yourself. And then, like, Pogan's not going to just keep talking about something where, like, the entire room doesn't want to hear it. If you want to hear it, then that's no, what Why I... do you always sound like you just woke up? You just sound like you just woke ah, up. And are requesting bed, breakfast and bre bed. Breakfast and bread. Like, Yo, geez, check into that, that institution Ooh. again, Canadian. Was that? I think it's creeping back in. What's that? I don't know if it's the stress of being exposed to people who don't tolerate you or what, but you definitely have like a semblance of psychosis setting in or something, dude. You're really, you're starting to slide back into this like nervous, agitated state. That's why you got so no, quiet I'm last fine. night. You really don't sound I'm fine. I'm fine. I haven't been back to the hospital in months. I think yeah, you should go back to that's the, the hospital. Problem. That's the problem. I'm not going yeah, back to the hospital for anything. I'll never, it's... I'll never. I won't go there in the near future. You sound very <clears throat> scatterbrained. Do you create cute pet names for your therapists in the same way that you do for people in here? Uh, my therapist thinks I'm doing fine now. We don't talk anymore that much. That's it. I've recovered. I'm like, well, I haven't completely, but I'm like marginally better. I, I, I'm doing so much better in my real life. It's not hard to improve on garbage. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Look, Pogan. You're covered the marginally better. Pogan, you know, if if okay, why Pogan, are you Pogan, making Pogan, fun of someone Pogan. who you think is mentally ill? Just a second. Just because he's Pogan. a rapist. Just a second, Pogan. You sitting down and crying really, really loud is not an argument. You sitting down and crying really, really, really loud is not an argument. If you want to have an argument, I'm game. But if you just want to sit down and cry really hard. And we're not interested, okay? And I don't know why that mushy brain of yours is having so much trouble computing the information that's being input into it, 
But whatever the reason is, right, I'm just telling you, I don't care. You want to have an argument? Let's have an argument. You want to cry? You sound a little agitated, man. You don't care. Shut the fuck up. Are you okay? Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. I think you should. Uh, I think you should get like a like a damp, warm blanket or something, or like a towel, maybe. Just try to calm down, just a couple notches okay. before you come back to the room. Okay, you, Hagar. You sound you sound very distressed. Hagar, Hagar, Hagar. I wasn't talking to you. Hagar, H Hagar. Shut up. That's it. No. Hey. Stop like it. That. Stop it. It yeah. doesn't work like that, clickety-click. Do you think your therapist stopped talking to you because she acknowledged you were a rapist? Wait, come in. Jack, Jack is in the room. Jack, how are you doing? Oh my god, Jack, Jack just showed Hi. Jack, Jack just showed I was wondering <laughs> where you were. Let's get what? matter and antimatter to collide and see what happens. Second. Stop, 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 stop. Jack, stop, why stop, did you... Stop, 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 Okay. Can I talk? No. No. Jack, why in did English. Darth deafen you yesterday? Why, why did Darth deafen you yesterday? What? Well, that's a strange question. <laughs> no, but why did why did it deafen you? He just ran out of nowhere, deafened you. Why do you wow. think that's surprising? <laughs> I, I don't think I, it's surprising. I love how he demands the right to ask stupid questions. No, but, no, but I wonder why people questions. don't let him finish the stupid Stop, 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 stop. No, no, but he didn't just mute you. He actually deafened you. He didn't want you to listen to him. Yeah, so because he hates you? Jack. Because he sees Jack as oh, a psycho. Gus. Gus. Sees... I... What? Who's gussing me? <laughs> He's talking to Jack. Jack, why Jack did, I why don't he... understand why he deafened you. It seems okay. Stop, stop. <laughs> why did he deaf? What was the what was the reason he actually deafened you? I, I didn't some realize kind of what... lashing out because you know he. It's one of the few opportunities he has to like get at me in some way. Without having, <laughs> without me having the opportunity to retaliate. Such a stupid question. That is hilarious. Darth was really angry yesterday. He tried to nuke the server. Oh. Then he got angry at me and called me ugly. Damn. Hey. Hey. That part is true. Doesn't much, doesn't much like you neither, does he, Can Cat? <laughs> he looks... Uh, Canadian looks like Alan DeLon. Do you guys know Alan DeLon? Yeah. You know, there's yeah, another person. He looks like, like the current person. day Edward Furlong. <laughs> There's another I'm gonna show that you. Like yeah, does. Do you know? <laughs> I don't look. I I I wish I looked like Alan Delon, but I don't. Was it you that was laughing like that? It was. was someone else. He looks like um Zizek's son. <laughs> I don't agree with Zizek. And but... sounds like. Yeah. After like a lot of neglect. <laughs> a lot of cocaine. <laughs> <laughs> you see, the thing is, baby, I, I need to hear your voice. Darth actually thinks. Darth, Darth actually told me that. Uh, Darth actually told me that I was as ugly from the outside as I was in the inside. Like he actually. Well, told he me supposedly that. looks like a cross between. Jay Leno and Steve Bannon, so I don't think he should be casting aspersions. <laughs> yes, but, um, no, on yesterday he said, um, this is going to be almost verbatim, but something like, I don't have any, uh, any, like, reser or, I don't know, hang ups or, like, some sort of insecurities about his looks. Um, and he says that uh, if, if you want to know what he looks like, he's he looks like an older Taylor Hicks. Really? Or Let me look up Taylor. Apparently. <laughs> the only reason the yeah. only reason he doesn't go on cam is because um, of stalkers. Wait, but Darth is bald though, right? He has stated in the past that he doesn't have hair. Oh, know. look. He's never mentioned how tall he is. Yeah, he has he has said repeatedly that he's bald, well at least to, to me. Why is he in Montero? Jack, do you yeah. know that Canadian Catholic is um taking on your mannerisms and, and Yeah, and... in fact Josh has Josh said that twice now Canadian went in to talk to EF and did better than almost all the atheists. 
who deal with him. And uh, it's got to be because he Gosh, just rehearses you. my arguments, right? Uh, that's, that's modest, Jack, right? It also doesn't help that, you know, he sticks his tongue up the F's ass. No, but he's always talking about my arguments. He, like, runs my arguments on Matt Slick and, like, all kinds of people. He's doing it all the time. Even and though why? he actually rejects the arguments, which is Yeah, weird. why is he still a Catholic, then? I no, I, I do. I don't I, understand. I reject it. He likes to see how they respond to the yeah. argument. It's really weird. Yeah, I do. But I, I, I reject atheism, obviously. I'm not an atheist. His but arguments are good arguments. I'm not. I'm not Catholic. But Jack's arguments are good arguments. He's a civic No, but look, look, look. Stop. No, I'm not. But look. Yeah. <laughs> Jack's, Jack's just a closet Christian. But the thing is. <laughs> what do you make of Matt, that? What do you make of that? That he always That's calls true. me a closet Christian. He's, a, cri oh, he's, a, he's a crypto he's Christian. Did Troyer just uh, get here? I'm still trying to figure out. Like, he seems to think that all your arguments are good, but. It seems to have no effect on his th his. Face. I don't think I don't they're good. I think they're valid. I think they're formally valid. So when they're formally <laughs> valid, <laughs> valid. No, the problem is that people like Matt Slick, for example, they don't acknowledge that it's formally valid. And so what frustrates So you have a problem with yeah. the truth of the premises? I have a pr I have a problem when they don't deal with it. Like for example, instead of saying the Euthyphro dilemma is a false dilemma, I say that yes, it is a true dilemma. I take the first horn. Here is why. Whereas someone will say the Euthyphro dilemma doesn't exist. So do you see the difference? I'm not saying that. What? Do you yeah, but see the difference? I don't. I don't think that there's a problem taking the first horn. Well, I mean, maybe down the I line, know. but but it's the problem is that people try to resist the dilemma. Right. I know, and that's what that's what I don't like. I don't resist. I say well, that most I'm people don't want to say that there's some sort of standard outside of God that he's appealing right, to. Right, exactly. Good. But Canadian Catholic is fine with being a heretic. Good. Yeah, that's you don't mind being a heretic, right? Well, I, I don't consider it heresy. I just consider well, it like a a being a visionary well, Catholic. You know, the fact he's a that heretic, Catholic. visionary, the fact that heretics don't can. The fact that heretics don't consider themselves heretics doesn't stop them from being burned at the stake, right? <laughs> well, I mean, that's just a personal <laughs> attack, right? Well, but he's what are you talking what about? Like, do it's not a personal what, what, attack. Stop, what stop, 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 stop. What did Matt Slick do yesterday? Why did he run? I, I wasn't there. In You're the running day. from just... Jack's question right now. <laughs> I wasn't, but stop, stop, stop. He... What did Matt Slick do? Uh, I don't know. Tofi was... Um objecting that he was engaging in shifting the burden of proof and then somebody over talked him and even though they apologized for over talking him that gave him the excuse to say um oh i thought i was no, but talking he has like full mods yeah but like he has full he has full mods he can ban people and mute people you know matt slick is kind of a nasty he must person. not have known he must not have Maslick. known that he had no, he, he I knows that. He knew that he had mods. He, he knows I don't that think he, he knew it yesterday. He knows that he has mods. And he, he, he actually mutes people. He actually mutes me too, even though I also have mods. But yeah, he, he does that. I don't know why he ran away yesterday. Oh, I think I, somebody's saying Matt actually doesn't know how to use. No, he does. He, he's muted people before. He's. I don't know why he does that, but I don't understand what's what's Matt's response to the Euthyphro dilemma. He just says there is no dilemma. I, that's what I've heard. I'm trying to remember. Yeah, he says that it's a false dilemma. He said no. He says there's a third option. He says there's a third option that uh, yeah, it's nature, good but... good is grounded in the the character and nature of God, or that that the good is God. That just means that it's a false dilemma. The... If there's a third option, it's a false dilemma. That's a trial number. Danny, Danny <laughs> being informative as always. Yes. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just teasing you, Danny. I couldn't resist that. You just left yourself said, wide open. I couldn't. <laughs> I thought Deglin was disputing that that was his view. That 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 he, what, that he, I thought he Matt Slick thinks it's not a true dilemma. No, I was just saying. I was just saying like what his view is, ultimately. Uh, Jack is not appreciating the depth of my argument from beauty, for God. I don't understand. <laughs> Who does the best 
Is is does Luca. Young do the best Luca, Canadian? Luca. Oh, Luca, Luca for sure. No, Luca but Luca sure. makes it sound a little too Slavic. German, like a little German. It's a little German. German, German. He has, that's what it is. But like yeah, he, yeah, yeah. he has the um, right. he has the timing and the rhythm very. You and Tom are getting down pretty good. Yours is very good, Young. <laughs> Jack, you think yeah. that Matt Slick is kind of a it's kind of like a nasty person? Like he's actually kind of like a bad person, right? No, I, he's worse yeah, than Darth. I think so. But I've mean, no, I I seen him. I have seen him be warm to people, so I know he's not that way all the time. But yeah, I would when say it's easy. he's. What's an example I'd of say him being basically a thug? I, I just like him like more but, intensely what is, than I what, just like what, Darth because like. I mean, I've said this in the book, but Darth at least has the potential to be like unintentionally comedic or something. You know, you extract some like comedic value out of his existence or something. Matt Slick is just intensely boring and an asshole. And I will retarded. never forget so that it's... Jack spent like an hour or two trying to explain the difference between statements, propositions, and... Oh, I um, remember that, yeah. You know, and, and then Matt Slick, after he left that, like it, it wasn't even a debate. Jack was just taking hours of his time to explain all of the terminology he goes back to a different room to Darth and says that, man, that Jack guy is such a loser. And I, I just, I, every bit of my respect flew out the window. I mean, it was just so, so low. Wait, just a second. What, what's, what, what's, what's an example? Like, for example, when people talk about Matt's daughter, he's also always so, like, respectful and says that, you know, you should respect non-believers and stuff like that. But what's an example of him being a nasty person? I, Danny I just gave it. one. Danny just gave an example. Here's the recording. Yeah, they, they, uh, they Tom come. posted it. Yeah. You see, listen, the guy's a loser in his personal life, right? That's and he's just, he, he thinks he's a philosophical genius. He's a sophist. If you look <laughs> at any of his arguments, they're sophistry. Hmm. <laughs> Wait, did why, why did why does why does he call you Angstreichs? What's what's with the ink, that pronunciation? Yeah, because his name is spelled with a ch at the end. Why does he add the extra s at the end? He always says something like Angstreichs. Who gives a fuck, dude? Damn. <laughs> I was wondering if was that with a... <coughs> no, he doesn't even do that. Angstreich. 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 Which either uh, means Dar something really badass or it means something bad. <laughs> 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 it, it, Angstreich either means like realm of fear or just fearful, like a coward, sort What's of. What's the realm of fear? Reich is like realm, or no, yeah. I mean, what is the realm of fear? I always thought it was like hell, analogous to hell, yeah. I guess something Einstein. like that, like the twilight sure. zone or something, yeah. But more likely, it means like coward. Does anyone know what like college Darth went yeah. to? Just out of curiosity, stop, stop. Does he anyone know what college. college Darth went to? He never stop, went stop. to college. Well, what if. Yeah, that's what no. I heard always. I don't think so. I don't. Who knows what? The Wait, actual... somebody told me well, that somebody told me that he went to Georgetown. It. That was his Wait, father. I thought somebody. Oh, he didn't go to Georgetown. No. <laughs> oh, then, then <laughs> no. I must have been. No. No. I thought I thought Darth blanked out of Georgetown. He never went to college. He's too dumb. Then how was he, he a dentist or whatever he was? He's not. How the hell was he a dentist? His father was a dentist. He's not a dentist. He's his father was a dentist. He's a um. He, he makes, makes dentures. dentures. So, yeah. He made dentures. He, he makes dentures. dentures. He makes dentures. So wait. So Mr. Batman is actually more educated than Darth, like formally. <laughs> That's surprising. I always expected Darth to be like a. No, Mr. Batman is a teacher. <laughs> Haven't you heard? He's a yeah, science do you, teacher. Uh, do you have a degree? No. What's that? I, I don't. 
Yeah, um, Canadian Catholic was in here, like, you know, using that to sort of dismiss and say other oh, people are dumb. And then it was. Well, I didn't say that. I didn't one. say that. And I then, just. I wanted and then, to trivially and then that know all what went, you're that all went away. And then he was like questioning in it because like his whole like worldview is falling apart because he wanted to be an elitist about this. <laughs> you don't I, ne- I never, I never, I never, I never, I never said that. I was just <laughs> trivially interested. That was like in a major, and he wouldn't. Disc- that was like Porky Pig right there. It was. I never, I, I don't, never, I don't, I don't, I never, I never. I say, I say, I say, I say. Wait, wait, just, just a second, just a second. So. Is like Mr. Batman has a degree, right, in some teaching or something, because he's a substitute a teacher. For what I, I mean, no, I don't think so. He's got no, like a certification or something, maybe. <laughs> I I like Mr. Batman. I actually am Mr. Batman's biggest fan. I mean, let's even say that Mr. Batman has a degree. Then what? Like all his dumb dumb arguments are somehow not dumb. Okay, Tom, I'm going to repeat what this for you since think? your brain takes a lot of time digesting information I give, right? It's I don't care smooth. about credentials. I want to know, stop. You do? I want to know I want to know it from the trivial perspective. So I want to know just for just for trivia. I'm not a credentialist. I don't care if somebody has degrees or doesn't. You've literally appealed to uh, not having a degree as justification I don't have, for why I'm, I'm, dumb. I'm still I'm, st- I'm still a student. I don't have a. Degree. Well, you're just saying you care, but you don't care that much. Is what you mean? Well, I care Obviously, from a trivial perspective. Yeah, but I care just because of like a trivial thing to know what someone's alma mater was, right? That's all I care about. No, you'd like knowing people's alma maters. Yeah, it's that's like just like from a trivial baseball cards or something. Yeah, just from a pre- trivial perspective, because degrees does the degree doesn't actually make someone sorry. Take Detroit for example; he has all his degrees hanging out on his walls, and he's still as dumb as he was when I first met him. So, uh-huh. oh shit! Uh-huh. He, you know, he destroyed your server. <laughs> Destroy you? Are you a mod on every server? I want to know. He, he, he has all the all the degrees there are. Detroit, are you wall, in? But... Are you in um, Canadian's new server? Is there it's one? not my server. It's not. I don't but have one. It's it's Canadian Catholic server under an alias that he doesn't admit to having, but that Darth oh, no, not really. managed to discover. <laughs> not really. I, I, no, it's not actually. But What's that the server, the server called? is called Philosophical Checkmate. Are you in there? It's oh, not actually mine. It? No, I'm not. it's his server. Canadian He's Bobby Boy. Make, will you make Detroyer a mod if he joins your server? I'm. I'm. I'm not. I, I just have admin there. I'm not like owner or anything. Yeah, so will you but as an admin you can appoint mods, right? No, he's the owner. He's Bobby Boy. Yeah, I made you I made you a mod, <laughs> Jack. Dude, I watch know. this. Jack, I know, Jack, watch I this. Think, did... Canadian Catholic, are you Bobby Boy? No. No. <laughs> oh. You know, you said you're not Saint Augustine said you're not supposed to lie. But anyway I'm not um, lying. The 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 um Detroyer will only join your server if you make him a mod. Would, would you? It's make not him mine, but it. But if he joins, he has to be a mod like in Theus Helpline. No Did you else. make? Did them. you create the server philosoph- philosophical checkmate? I don't see what relevance that makes. But <laughs> <laughs> <it's not> a- <laughs> I knew when he said that he's not Bobby Boy. That was just a, like a Mark Thomas no. So oh that just means God. that in some sense. He's not right, Bobby Boy. Right, you know, right. Like like what he was probably thinking was, I'm not Bobby Boy. My name's Canadian Catholic. I can <laughs> I'm looking at it right now, you know. <laughs> either way. Just so so either dishonest. Way. Either way. I had I had a I had a uh, the thing is, Jack, what's your alma mater? I forget. Something in oh New God. York. I went Columbia, to state, Columbia. I went to the State University of New York at Purchase, but I didn't graduate. I go to Columbia, you but act- not as a enrolled student. I just sit in on classes there. Columbia, I've heard so many stories about Columbia. I didn't know about the New York State, but I, I love Columbia, just from the pictures I see. A lot of hot Asian girls. Okay. A lot of cocaine. You're, 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 you're... If you like Asian girls, then you'd probably like Columbia. <laughs> 
for some reason, all universities are populated. For some reason, all universities are populated by Asians. Is, is, is there anyone why. more peculiar than Kenyan Catholic? It's pretty peculiar. Columbia has a really good faculty. Look at that. Look at just a second. Just a second. Jack shares alma mater with Twitter's founder. Okay, he actually what? shares alma mater with. Yeah, J uh, Twitter's founder actually went to the same college he did. Let me see who else. Amazing. That's no, he's great by amazing. proxy then. I guess right. rich by proxy. I guess so. Let me see. The founder of Twitter, though, you I guys... I didn't know that guy. Right? What's his name? Jack something. Jack Dorsey. Oh. Jack Dorsey. Dorsey yeah. No, I don't think I knew him. But he might have been much later than when I was there. I don't know his age. He's younger than you, Jack. Yep. Little who's a, who's a, who's a famous professor in Columbia, Jack? Name one. I don't. I don't really. Who's a good um, lecturer in Columbia? Kiel Bogrami. Yeah, Kiel Bogrami, the best <laughs> philosopher ever. He's actually in Columbia. He's actually in Columbia right now. Yeah. yeah. I think Brian There's Green. There's much more there. famous people there. Yeah, I think Brian Green. Isn't Brian Green there? He's like a physicist, yeah. Brian Green. That's cool. He's much more famous. There's like Bjarnus. In CS, there's like Bjarnus Strustrup, who created like C. No, they used like to have Brian Oliver Green. Sacks. Oh, he yeah. Was pretty, he was pretty famous, mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. Have you ever been to Cornell? I, I've heard that Cornell University is also pretty high level. Jesus Christ, man. Hey, Pogan, welcome back. Good to be back, dude. <laughs> Pogan. Have you noticed that Actually, Pogan and, Have you noticed that Pogan and Canadian Catholic are in the same room, Jack? Like, there's dimensional I rifts love being created right now. There's like... I, I holes in I the like, fabric I like of space Pogan. I, I, I don't dislike Pogan. I, I actually like Pogan. I, I well, you're the same Pogan. person, so... <laughs> we have the same interest. <laughs> we have the same interest, too. I'm also into medicine. No, you are I, him, I, I, and he is you. Well, there is there is one interest that isn't. I never, I never, I never, I never, I never, I never said that. I was just <laughs> trivially interested. You, you really like the guy that... You like the... Come on, you like the guy that calls you a rapist every other word? Well, that's Pogan because he's a prefers, moron, but other than but that, you he's like a... his... Okay. You like him? Canadian, well, he's just, he's con it's just his conscience speaking moron. to him. Right, I'm Canadian Catholic's disembodied conscience, just reminding the him of his sins. The difference is that Pogan prefers black girls to Asian girls, but <laughs> they have to be shackled. And Pogan <laughs> is actually proud of his Mongolian heritage. As a we also to... David Albert. <laughs> Pogan, we're, Pogan, David we're the Albert. same height he's too, right? Yeah, he's awesome. Yeah. Stop, stop, stop. Just a second, Pogan. Oh, that, that's, that, that's also in Colombia? David Albert. Let Albert's. me look him up. Yeah, he's pretty famous. What do you want, rapist? Yeah, Pogan and me are Robert the same height Mondo? too, right? Me and Pogan are the same height how, as well. How tall are you, Canadian Catholic? I'm You're not the same eight. height as Pogan. He's like 6'3". Just a second. I... <laughs> You're 6'3", Pogan? Fuck I off, know. bro. You're actually tall. Wow. I'm 5'10 in the mornings, 5'9 in the afternoon. Hogan uh, <laughs> is, also on, is also on steroids, Canadian. Oh my god. god. He's also adding his morning erection. I've never... How can I identify a hundred different species of birds? Jackie. That's right. I never had somebody tell me their height in the morning versus at night. <laughs> no, I actually record. I actually record the differences, and it actually drops by an inch. I, why, I, do, why do you? You, you are just the weirdest motherfucker with, in the yeah. world, dude. <laughs> just the absolute strangest fucking yeah. person. If you take your yeah, if you just take your shoes have, off, that doesn't count as your height actually decreasing by an inch. <laughs> no, that's not what I mean. I mean, if you take your height in the morning and then in the evening, you lose an inch or something. I've tried it many times. That's that's true. I've I've seen it happen. I measure myself almost every day, and I I, I actually know you how measure you yourself why do you every do day. Why do Why do you do that? Are you expecting a growth spurt, or what is that about? Well, because when when you're a, yeah, when you're a beast, when you're a beast, 
I'm, I'm, when I've gained weight, right, I think <laughs> that's actually impacting my height. So I'm trying to see if I'm going to get taller. <laughs> it's because the fat goes to the bottom of your feet. Uh, no, yeah, that can be true, actually. That's how that happens. Um, but... yeah, you do. Yeah. Your spine decompresses while you sleep. And then in the morning, you're a little taller. And then after you've been standing up for a while, you're it a baller. You, can't, you lose the height. Yeah. yeah. So I actually have like a. I actually like marked my wall so I can measure myself every day. <laughs> oh my god, my grandma used to do that to me when I was a kid. You do that to yourself still yeah, as an adult? Every, not every day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like maybe Almost once a year. <laughs> no, I actually what? Like, do that. My brother measures me or my mother. I actually sometimes ask them. But yeah, we. I I like to. But I didn't know Pogan. You were so tall. I thought you were like my height. Oh wait, wait, Tom. I have a question. What is is Dart? That? Does Darth think that um, there's still a chance that Trump could win, like with these legal challenges? You know, has, he you, given, has he given up hope? You know, Canadian. No, no, no. I I have him saying that he thinks that on inauguration day, it is more likely that Trump will be sworn in than Joe Biden. <laughs> he just keeps making it worse Damn for himself. It. You know How his could he uh, be so stupid. Oh my his god! Le- his legal team actually uh, bailed on him in Pennsylvania. Yeah, oh, didn't really? someone like resign or something? That's true. No, yeah. they had they had a few resign from it. One resigned over the summer, though. That was the first one. They they dropped, they, they, they they dropped, well. They, well, but it's not. Like it's because they're doing like a recount, anyways. That's why they dropped the cases in like Arizona, I think Nevada too. In PA, expi- uh, it, uh, it was explicitly just the law firm is changing. They they bailed on Trump. I know. Yeah, some, yeah. you definitely. Yeah. Some uh, things were thrown out, but I thought he uh, he had something ruled in favor in his favor in uh, in Michigan. Does anybody know about that? Some judge ruled in no. Trump's favor. I saw a headline. It stands to reason. On, 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 what? Bill. Well, on December 14th, like, the state electors, the state legislators can award him the electoral college votes. Some like 30, only 33 states have laws that require uh, electoral votes going a certain way. So there is a chance, a very, 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 very small chance. That the electoral college would uh, give him all the. The number? The electors of... <laughs> that's, what they do that. that's, no. that's what Darth the, Dawkins is counting on. It's just possible. That doesn't make that's any sense. Small, that's small chance. But it's just, the it's just possible. electors of certain states. You got that it's impossible. Well, highly unlikely. Highly impossible. Not there's, the whole college, right. just the electors Darth, of certain Darth states thinks there's where the a law point. allows them to choose who they... They cast their Jack and JJ's doing his right, thing. Shut up. Dar- Darth thinks. Darth thinks there's a point. Did you know this, Detroit? Darth thinks there's a point at which a number, a, an improbability, can become so large that it becomes impossible. That's fun. That's fun. That's correct. <laughs> you mean love that. Impossible. You remember the gay kid that would also always <laughs> he say calls love that, that the law of large numbers. He oh calls yeah. That large numbers. Yeah, he calls that the law. Yeah, he calls that the law of large numbers. I didn't never thought someone would have a worse understanding of it than sugar. Uh, (laughs) What's the same? That's the same as sugar. No, it's worse. It's the law of numbers. It's just (laughs) unbelievable. I've got a question. Canadian, when you um, go to prison, do you think you'll finally lose the fucking Jesus, weight? Pogan. Are you talking to yourself, uh, uh, Pogan? Yeah, Pogan yeah, is a little too much, bro. Your brain's, your the, brain's this is a little bit my too theory much now. for me. My, fu- my functioning yeah, so Pogan... theory now is that when Pogan lost weight, he sort of like left behind Canadian Catholic. Like Canadian Catholic <laughs> is Pogan before losing the weight, basically. They had just sort of disembodied were... from the original body. And then became an entity. You no, know, so Canadian Catholic actually <laughs> likes Pogan. But... Wait, what if um? So the the, the context that you've missed is Wait. that for the last hours, like Pogan has been calling him a rapist. You know, like multiple <laughs> right. times. And then Canadian He's like, I actually really like Pogan. I like Pogan. But he doesn't have guy. anything against mm. morons. Okay, maybe it's okay. 
It's fine, Jackie. Say it. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, I was acting. So, no, it's okay. Um, what if it's not that um, Canadian Catholic is what Pokemon was before you lost the weight, but Canadian Catholic is the the weight like separating the from Pokemon. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly. You know what's funny what is, is that Canadian Canadian Catholic denies that he's Canadian Catholic now. Not only does he deny what? that he's Bobby Boy. You saw with Darth Dawkins that Darth's, Darth, like, he came in as David Lee Roth into one of Darth's channels, and Darth was like, you're Canadian Catholic. And he said, no. <laughs> no. <Nope. laughs> right. <laughs> it's David Lee Roth. He's not no. Canadian <laughs> You right. cannot prove that That's I am stupid. Canadian Catholic. You cannot prove yeah. it. <laughs> <laughs> Canadian is so hilarious. Can you explain I, to I, us, Canadian? Can you like actually explain to me why you yeah. say sometimes that you're speaking in English as opposed to just speaking? Huh? Why do you sometimes say I'm speaking in English as opposed to saying I'm speaking? I I'm I'm multilingual. Hagar, I see you. Oh my god. He, he actually was speaking another language towards his mother last night on cam. Detroyer is a troll. Detroyer? What is Detroyer? No, because Hagar, Hagar actually records people against their will. She, she has a whole YouTube channel. Shut up. She, ha, she has a whole YouTube channel. She has, she has, she has, she has, shut up. She has a YouTube channel dedicated to it. It's called Hagarism. And it's her... And she she does that. She's a trans person who records others against their will. What wife. the fuck? All right, That's enough with this. You're a fucking about. piece of shit, dude. You're fucking awful, man. <laughs> Why would you never, fucking say that, dude? I never, I never, I never, I never said that. I was just <laughs> trivially interested. You're disgusting. You okay. fucking piece of uh, shit, dude. Yeah, there was yeah. no. Yeah. All right, okay. Canadian Catholic. Okay. <clears throat> In regards Please. to that stuff, like the next time you do that, it's gonna be auto mute. Okay, stop fucking what personally attacking people as much as you do. If you if you oh, yeah. say if you say yeah, what did I do, down. then you're getting auto muted. Oh yeah, Canadian denies his own existence. I forgot about that. The I don't deny my existence. I think that, that you, you did think for, your the long, for the for the longest time. No, no, no. Skeptical of the idea. No, no, that no, I, I, may, that you no, no, no. The idea is that oh, existence yeah. is an incoherent concept because of oh, the improbable. Uh, <laughs> 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 make sure he's okay god cc it must be painful to be you man he literally ceased existing hey um tom how confident is darth that that uh trump will be the one inaugurated <laughs> uh well he said well that's i mean that he's he said that he thought it was more likely so he was, he that's, where did he say that? I missed that. He actually said that? Yes. That's pretty confident. I mean, to say that it's more likely than Biden, that seems like... Well, it just means your confidence is 51% or something, right? Like, well, at least. Well, I don't know if the at real least. like world... It could be, could be 90. Like, yeah, right. Yeah, but the so tone. It, what was the tone? Was the tone... Like, uh oh, it's very sort of like... Oh, I'm not worried about it. You know, <laughs> come election day. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's fantastic. <laughs> this will go down with his other infinite, He has like uh, a mentality that's, that's always like, you know, it's basically ain't no bitch. It's like the winning, always winning and then robbed mentality. So he always wins up to the point in which he loses. And then he, he like legit, something. legitimately won, but they just like were. Yeah, it was robbing. Yeah, it was like a steal or something. I mean, he always really won, you know. You yeah, know, we yeah. never we never surpassed what thirty thousand deaths of COVID, right? Yeah, twenty. <laughs> that was Jesus. all. That was all most. pre-existing conditions. That wasn't COVID killed. Us. Jesus, but yeah. like, the the funniest thing is that like his original original was like. It won't go up upwards of twenty five thousand. Come on, just super cocky. About At a it. time when it was twenty five thousand, it was eighteen thousand. There was yeah that day. Day 
You know, it was crazy. And it was like five months. It was yep. a prediction. In August, I think it, it was 2000 at that point. It was just, you just. It was yeah, but over. You with, guys... It was over 2000 in like a week. Do you guys say it's over? Counting, you, you guys are counting the illegal deaths, right? We got to oh, be yeah. counting the legal deaths. <laughs> <laughs> but the thing is, when he's talking about the flu, those flu numbers are not just deaths by flu only. Those are also people with pre-existing conditions. But he'll say 25,000 is flu numbers, right? But by his own lights, it's not. Wait, so what's Dart's opinion on, like, healthcare? Does he have... He doesn't support... <sighs> Fuck, like, dude. Stuff? It's probably stupid. He's He's for it when it's needed. He's for, like, two-tier system? Oh, my God. I can't hear you, Tommy. I can't hear you talking. I'm not speaking. Okay, then somebody was over talking to you, probably. It was Krogan. But I've talked with Dark. You really just want, want me to, to fucking just make this absolutely nightmarish for you every day, don't you? You really <laughs> just want Pogan. me to. You really. You're, you're, you're like really fucking begging me to Pogan. just constantly fucking go after you, dude. That's really what you want, it isn't was... it? It was Pogan. Who's scary? I'm just fucking. Ooh. Look, I'm just drawing a Pogan picture. You can find it. I'm just oh, fucking. Oh. Look, I'm just quietly sitting here drawing a picture for. I'm not even fucking saying anything. You, for no fucking reason at all, bring my I'm name sorry. up, dude. Okay, I Keep my was, fucking was, name was, out of your I mouth, never, asshole. I never, I never, I never po said po that. I was just <laughs> trivially interested. Don't Pogan, be intimidated. You're, you're, Pogan, you're over talking, Tom. Your trivial interests are probably if, <laughs> you're over talking me. If yeah, the picture, if the picture is like a, a very crude stick figure with an arrow pointing and saying "rapist" and like, it's yeah. like <laughs> that's gonna be Jeez. really funny. Keep Jack, you name to go after you? I'll go after you yeah, too, Pogan. Jack. Don't think just because you fucking well. We are, you scared, well are you scared, Jack? Are scared of? I big, actually big like. <laughs> I actually Big. like Pogan. <laughs> but isn't it isn't it super frightening to think that Pogan may go after you? I mean that must be like a frightening <laughs> prospect. What is he He's doing? just so big. He's going to lower Don't. my volume. <laughs> <laughs> Can anybody be opposed to uh, listening to the entirety of Tipsy? By I'm Pogan? going... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm going yes, I'm going what is it, dude? Let's listen to that. Yeah, okay. it's a great idea. Hey. 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 Bad phone cunt, dude. Hey. Does anyone know what sugars? Hey. Does anyone know what hey. sugars? Hey. Listen, you're a you're a <laughs> you're a motor mouth. You're a motor mouth. You don't know what to fight. I know politics better than you. You're talking about. I've been listening to you for the last 15 minutes. <laughs> oh, I, I know what I'm talking about. That. You know, you, know, you, know, you don't know what the fuck evidence. you're talking. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. I know politics better than you do, and, I, and I, I will challenge you at any point. You're a moron. I know politics better than you. How old are you? <laughs> How old are you? <laughs> That's none of your business. I'll ask you one more time. How? <laughs> How old are you? I refuse to answer. Good. Goodbye.